everyone welcome back to my channel so i am outside ikea i haven't been here in a good like it might even be eight months you know um so i'm literally just gonna go in now and show you watching you in because i'm sure you all want to see there's actually no queue in the car park's dead it's about four o'clock if that helps anyone because i know everyone's like dreading a queue or anything and also i've had my sunglasses sitting here so there is a line by the way um i was like oh my god look at the state of that it looks like i've got a big massive spot or something anyway um so i'm just gonna run in now and show you watching you i've got a few things that i do want to get a hold of so i'm hoping that it's in I'm really excited to finally be back at ikea like how much have we missed it please I I don't think the food hall's open, which is a bit guttering, but yeah. Anyway, let's go in. We've been in here five minutes, and look at them. They are literally reminding me of the Fame Living ones, which are so good, but I don't think you've got them. Um, I don't know whether they're just for sure, to be honest with you. How cute is he? Nine pounds. I don't know what his purpose is, but he's cute. I love all the setups they do because I get loads of inspo, obviously for visual merchandise. And I love these. They're nice, aren't they? Weird if you don't open every cupboard, by the way, in IKEA. Weird. And um, they've got this other little setup over here see if there's anything new i don't know whether there is though i love the way you can just put like handles on your ikea drawers i mean i've got loads of these it's just nice to see isn't it just the usual around here to be honest not seeing anything new i'm looking for ideas for the studio at the in um doesn't seem to be that near but i like this whole idea of a pegboard but i'm just not sure this marble finish i think now they are actually doing them made to measure and um, with the marble finish absolutely gorgeous i love as well these placemats they've stacked them to make it like a bit of a styling centerpiece love that love getting styling ideas from here and i like that as like back display piece as well because it shines the light and it'll make the room look bigger especially if there was a mirror oh my god they've got cloches i got one like this but just plain we've got the wooden base ones they're gorgeous i love the finish on that as well like the mac gray can you see that Gorge. How fab's this kitchen? I literally just am in my element when I'm in here, you know, you even that's gorge, like isn't it? I like them tiles as well. I love the way everyone's doing the half tiles paint, that's still a thing. But yeah, absolutely love that. Let's go through to the garden. Love all the little garden bits at them in. Cute little planter ideas. Gorgeous little bit. Oh, and by the way, through this window here, can you see that chair? Let me let me show you. This is a is like a H and M dupe at the minute. Like everyone's raving about it. Um, I think it's only seventy five pounds. I want to say. Okay, it's not five pounds. I've had that's a cushion. And um, but you can literally get the similar one in H and M, but this one's cheaper. It's literally exactly the same. Um, and then they've got as well this little like magazine mat, but they use it to store cushions, which is nice. But I don't know whether I like the whole cushion idea. Depends if you want more soft or not. New in chairs. Absolutely love these. Very good value for money, by the way. £529. And super soft. I would give it an 8 out of 10 for comfort rating because I just sat on it. I absolutely love this one as well. And the leather finish as well is 629, which is amazing. Love the way they've styled that as well on top of there. IKEA are branching out. Beautiful orange, burnt orange one as well. And you know what? I absolutely love this. It is a bit low, like I'm just gonna sit on it. It's a bit low, but it's really, really nice. But I like the arms on these as well, they're absolutely gorgeous. And you can pick your finish as well. What more do you want, you guys? What more do you want? I will love them. They're like wooden leaves. How much are they? 45 quid, what a bargain. Love them chandeliers as well. I love all the room sets you do actually. Let's go and have a little gander. This is nice. 
little corner sofa. I got some of the stickers on the walls. Little solutions for your walls and all different ways and desks as well. You know what's so clever as well? A little merch tip for anyone who wants to get into it. People always have just these little bits like this because they want it to make it look like this is lived in. So that's why they put real clothes in the wardrobe and that because it makes you want to buy it more. Top tip from Feminine Interiors. Nice little bedspread. Cute mirror. Um, do you know what? It's mad. It's like literally a house. Like it's literally like a house setup, isn't it, mad? I'm not seeing anything that's like reaching out to me. I really am not. It's nice, but it's not like unreal. Do you know what I mean? God, I love this. All matte black vibes. The finish on the work top. It is a huge vibe. I love the styling in the kitchen as well. The matte black sink. <gasps> no use. How fab. This is the gorgeous little snug idea as well. This reminds me of like a bachelor pad, like men's den kind of vibe. But it's really, really nice. Love all these little bits as well. The lights are gorge. And as well, if we come through here, look how gorgeous that is. That is literally like the H&M light that I put a swipe up for the other day. Oh my god, that's gorgeous. I don't know whether I prefer the H&M one, but that one is only 60 quid. Oh my god. If you're after the H&M, that's basically a dupe. This is a gorgeous couch. I can imagine that to be comfy. They also had that in H&M. Right here and H&M just on the same wavelength right now. So I feel like these are all like the OG IKEA like tables and whatever. And then they've got a few like ratani wicker ones over there, which are just average. Oh, that's a nice basket. I wonder if that's for sale. These are like the new style ones as well. Lifts with one hand and makes it easy to carry around the home. See, IKEA is so clever about stuff like that. Because you do need to carry a side table, don't you? So I do like them, but I don't love them. Do you know what I mean? Here is the Tom Dixon sofa. There's literally so many different ways you can have these and they're actually on sale, which is amazing. They're like £450 and I love that throw as well, but no, they are good. OMG, I love that dome light. I think they sell these um, shades separately, you know, because I swear I've seen that before. Oh, and I love this. They've kept that styling from months ago. Absolutely love that. I love the way they do the shelf styling as well. You've literally sectioned it perfectly. I absolutely love it. And that mirror as well just bounces the light in a room like if this was a real room set. Like, they just look amazing. And I love the idea as well of putting lights in the corner of a room. Because at most, like more often than not, we're just used to putting them in the centre. But isn't that just gorgeous? It just sets it up for a different mood for your room. And the curtain along the back wall instead of wallpaper. Another very witty idea for my here. These are nice as well. They'd be nice for like a little comfortable office, £165. So whether you get them in a different colour, I hope so, because I'm not a fan of the burnt orange. And can we talk about IKEA robbing me drinks cabinet idea? The cheek. God. So I seen this in their magazine. It is a footstool slash magazine like holder for £60. Now that is really gorgeous. It's like giving me the wicker vibes that are very in this year. So how do we feel if they are multifunctional? I feel like I'd have to put like a upholstered cushion on the top, I don't know. I don't know how I feel. Let me know in the comments below if you like it. I feel like it's very H&M. But £60, you can't complain. Why has it just made me think I need these memorable moments with after and biscuits? Like the tagline, like I'm sold, like I need a packet. I really like these. £35. Am I alright if I need to pick any not? Where does it say £35? £35. £35. Love that. I love the linen shade. I prefer just the shade on a turn to be honest with you. But I really like that. Clever idea for anyone who's just got like a yard. Really, really gorgeous idea. Mini bistro set, and it's like half the table, you know, into the wall. With like solar powered lights and just all storage solutions at the back as well. I just think that's a really clever idea. IKEA are good at that though. Oh my god, love this outdoor rug as well. Isn't that nice? 
nice finish on that and that lantern's gorge it's only 17 pounds it's solar powered so perfect for outside as well all at real vars like the size of that oh my god it's 19 pounds you can it where's that out to and 19 pounds let's go just imagine that there's like a proper fire love it the cozy vibes this room is giving me oh my god there's that light as well in silver prefer the black i think i know that's a shock for me because i love silver but i'd love like a little pantry like this to store everything is that not just a dream but like this glass thing into the kitchen the glass thing with windows am i okay i swear these are like the baskets mrs hinch has um, i think they're like a tenner each though but you can get them in different colors i don't know why but i want one and i have no use for them i think these would be the perfect color maybe for me office to like a creamy gold hmm debatable i really like this desk and it's only 150 pounds but you know what i think it's very low but look at this new in chair for 50 pounds oh oh my god is that not just so gorgeous that is absolutely stunning and it's only 50 quid love that zip detail on the back like oh my god looks designer i love these wireless charging things they have by the way but i want a white one and you've only got the black and gold one which is still nice you've actually got a few oh my god you've got that chair in navy as well so that'll have a zip back and they've got all the other standard office chairs that they get in as well which are nice but they're not like unreal do you know what I mean? i'm struggling with the tables because they're all low but this one has got an up and down button i don't know if it works it's 415 pounds but i can set the height is that gonna focus yeah i can set the height so if i wanted to stand up and work i could and if i wanted to sit i could i quite like that but like i don't like the color and I don't know whether it looks too office like I want my office to look nice, do you know what I mean? Oh, eh? This is like the new like light room. So it says that these are like the essentials to sleeping. I don't even know what this room is, you know. So it says that light should be good for sleep. I hear like the sleep experts on, they? they always say that. He said sounds, our brains leave it one ear open. Oh my god, this is like a museum news, like what the hell? Oh my god, some sounds can actually help you sleep, such as white noise. Mad. Eh. This is crazy. Do you find that crazy? And then what's here? Comfort. This is literally like a museum. We all have need for comfort. A good mattress is fundamental. That's mad. So this must mean I think these are like their fat top tips for a good sleep, I'm presuming. So temperature, light, sound, air and comfort. So IKEA must help you with that. Oh here we are. Are you getting enough sleep? Let us show you how to with five sleep essentials. Well, there you go guys. You seen it here first. The Secrets to a good night's sleep. unreal is this room love these little side tables i don't know whether they're new you know 25 pounds you can store your little books in there i think that's gorgeous there's the h&m dupes by the way love the cushion arrangement the mustard in like a male room is really a lovely touch and everyone is doing this paddling 
and it works so so well with a like wardrobe on show and a little work from home setup. They design this so perfectly, you know. I love this little side cabinet as well. Beautiful, just so simple and effective. I love it. To honest opinion, you use like I know it's hard to tell on the camera, but what do you think of this, right? It's proper the arty vibes, isn't it? And you can literally alter it. So you can buy these in here, these like legs, and you can get them in white. So I'm thinking for my desk to have them and buy my own like topper. I really, really like that. You know, because like obviously if I'm doing more like proper drawings and that, it'll be perfect that size or flat. Let me know what you think in the comments below. I need your advice on a desk now because it's getting serious use. But why is everything cuter when it's small? Look at that little kid's chair. The OG IKEA chair. And look at this one. <gasps> I would have to get my kid that, like, it is so cute. I just spotted this. So, they are ceiling lights. And they put a plant in them and stuck them out the wall. Like, isn't that the cleverest IKEA DIY I've ever seen? That is insane. I'm just amazed by that. Nice, that's, that's the scent test. Now these are all the new candles. So they've got peach, vanilla, apple for summer. And they've got like storage bags here. I feel like this is just a random like transitional aisle when you come from one bit to the next, isn't it? They've got all little gorgeous woven pots, fake plants. The OG IKEA frames, I think we've all seen. Storage boxes that go in absolutely everything because I've got them in white. We've got all the summer glassware. And I love this little bamboo tray. It's absolutely gorgeous. It's only a tenner. Imagine that on the outdoor bar. Do you know what I mean? And you've styled it here with some balloon gin glasses. I absolutely love the glasses in IKEA. Oh my god, you have got these. I'm going to see how much this is because I want one. I might have to buy one of them if it focuses. I love that. God, found them. They've got loads. for £2 and they are gorgeous. £2.50 even. I've seen people put like cereal and everything in these but they call them crafts. Why do they the crafts? I think they're better just as storage. So I'm going to pick one up and see what it looks like. And as well, they've got these which they're saying is for wine. But isn't that a nice vase? I'm sorry, that's not for wine. That is definitely for me flowers. I love these cups that they do, you know. We've got them in grey. I love them. A pink one, I might get one. They're only £1.75. I've also got a matte black one as well. So I'm just cast. I will be running a mile, thank you. Oh my God, stop it. A little knitted ottoman. Oh my God, £15. Oh, it's a cover. Oh, I love that. £15 is an absolute bargain and I love the idea of having these baskets with frozen in your garden as well because it does get cold doesn't it all the little accessories they've got with them are gorgeous just vibey isn't it there's my carafe I've just picked up probably have my cereal in it to one else I love this as well little outdoor brown stained chair only £60 gorgeous oh my god you how sick of these so people in our work always come in and ask us do we sell these because we like merch inside them and they are amazing so if you've got a shop or you sell homeware or fashion or jewelry or whatever these are amazing and they're flat packed as well and they're 12 pound and they're great like a merchandising tool i would literally have these as a staple if you want them to be within merchandising or whatever 12 pound you can't say no so how clever are these the 75p shoe organizers for inside your wardrobe or in your shoe storage wherever you have it and you put one shoe tucked under and one shoe on the top to save room i literally need them in my life they are amazing for 75p as well insane so mg wicker basket heaven unreal so that one's 25 pounds these are gorgeous i seen them before didn't i the bamboo ones 22 pounds for the set of two and this is beautiful nine pounds I think I seen one on Amara Home. Very expensive, beautiful dupe, and I absolutely love it. Nine pounds can't go wrong. And these are boss. I've never seen anything like that before. How fab! Let's see how much they are. Twelve pounds, bamboo and turquoise. Love that. And a few more little basket storage solutions here. 
I don't know if we at the end as well. Love mixed materials at the menu now. It's a vibe. Oh, how beautiful are these vases? Unreal. They are £15, but they are eco friendly because they have no waste, apparently. Aren't they beautiful? And they've got, oh my god, they've got a banana candle use. I can't confirm that smells heavy like banana. What are the other flavours? I don't know what this is. Oh, that's coconut, that's amazing as well. Oh, I love all the candles. And if I hear about the game with these quirky vases, haven't they? That's like a dome upside down clash. We've got black ones, blue ones. Oh, wow. Stop it. Oh, no, I don't like the blue. Nine pounds, that is unreal. That is like the vibe of my office, minus the blue. I love these little ones as well, which would be gorgeous to spray. They're only 375. Do you know what? You could actually spray these, so I don't know why I'm moaning. Look at the texture on that. Wow. Yeah, you could spray them, you know. Always look at the style and shape and texture as opposed to the colour, because you can always spray them. Like that, like texture wise, like gorgeous. Colour wise, not me, but sprayed, unreal. Apparently, star from two pounds, this is telling me. Or just the, them ones. I don't know, but I love them. This, the flower lounge. Let's go in. Installation, love that. Now I have held world's smallest bonsai tree. Aren't they good for money? Do you know what? I think I'm gonna get one, you know. I'm actually gonna get one of these. <laughs> They're supposed to bring you luck and fortune and money, so do you know what I mean? Like I need one in my life. They're so cute as well. They're like Barbie size, so you've got a little a little one with a Barbie house, they'd be gorgeous for outside the front door. They are so cute. I think I want to get one of them, you know. Oh, gorge. A little cloche with some greenery in. We love that. And I love these. Do you know what? I don't even love them for like water and plants. I just love them for show. I think they're really cute. I'm made up with my bonsai tree, you know. That's going in my studio. Good luck and fortune. I'm, I'm buying it for myself to bring all the prosperity I need. You know where? It's moody in this section, you know. In the plant section. Mad. But I absolutely love these plant holders on the top. I don't know where I can find these, but we get stuff like that in our work, but it's very rare. We've got all gorgeous faux plants and plant pots. The gold ones are gorgeous, look at them. Love that. So I swear, um, Ikea read my um, university dissertation, Biophilia, the connection between humans and nature to support physical health and mental, we mental well-being. I literally rave about biophilic design. It's so true, you know? Like, it actually does affect your mental health, having plants, even if they're fake. So, take that into account, you just, like, look at all these fabulous selection. I don't know how I feel about the blue. Is that to grow them? What is going on? So, I'm finally out of Ikea, and that is what is new. Um, I have got a few bits. I don't know whether to do the whole on the end of this video or on another video, but I'm sure you'll know, depending on how long this video is going to go on for. Um, but they had some fab bits, didn't they? I got some great ideas for the studio and also for merchandising, because it's just nice to get like ideas going into there, which I really do like. Um, the food hall wasn't open. Why did I think it was? Because you can only outdoor eat. They should have a little outdoor terrace. Are they not thinking ahead? I don't know why they're not doing that. I had an absolute ball. Do you remember when IKEA used to be like a proper like big family day out? Is that still the case? Because I genuinely think it is because I absolutely love IKEA. Um, but yeah, that is all from me. So yeah, anyway, I hope you enjoyed and I hope you're gonna go to IKEA. Let me know if you've been already or if you're gonna go or if you wanna go now you've seen this video. I don't know. Um, but yeah, thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to my channel to keep up to date with everything interior design over on Feminine Interiors. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye.